voice break because I'm in a little corner. Um, I cut my fringe too short as well, which has really annoyed me, but we move. Um, I'm in an airport. I'm in an airport about to go to Rhodes. I'm currently waiting for Luke outside the toilets. It's high class life. But yeah, I thought I would start this vlog and say, hello, this is what we're doing. Here he is. Let's go. Ready to go for your security. <clears throat> yeah, man. Oh, <laughs> that was horrible. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, it's taken the edge off them two coffees I've already had. I know, I know. We woke up so early and it's just been like all go and oh the music playing in there as well. But it's been all go and now it's like we've finally stopped, ordered some food, got a drink, can start to like get in the holiday mood. I mean, we didn't pay a lot for the holiday, so we can't really say anything. But this is the room. So this is bed here. Then we have like a sofa here, and then we have a little balcony, and then we have this little side where we have a fridge. How do you do it when you do it like that? Like Luke that. trying to tie his. Um, yeah, literally like that. Yeah, I'd do it like that. Trying to tie his little jumper, little stool, telly. There's not really a view because we didn't have a sea view, we had like a street view because obviously it was less. So this is the little balcony, which I think will do, it does the job. We've got like a little, um, oh, I can't see, little chair and table just there look. and then that's the view. And then the sea is in the distance that way. And then there's like the street that way. So yeah, I mean, it's pretty basic, but does the job for a week. So, somewhere to rest our heads. That's the main thing. That bed doesn't really look that comfy, let's Very be honest. Cool. Let's, have a, let's have a test. Oh, do you know what? It's, little... it's actually not that, yeah, I do. <laughs> it's actually not that bad, you know. Try it. Well, like, very soft. Yeah, it's nice. Look at me. <laughs> so we've walked to the harbour. This was... Yeah, no, that's what I said. There's like a little piazza. How far was this walk, do you think? Five minutes. Five minutes? We passed some like quite nice areas as well, like some restaurants and stuff. So, yeah, we're just basically exploring today. Exploring what we can see. People are in big, big puffer coats. <laughs> <laughs> he picks it up. There is actually a little fish in here. Can you see? You can see them. I'm like David Attenborough. <laughs> <laughs> Found a little like cafe. What's it called? Give it a go. Actino. Actiana? I have no idea. But it's very nice. Most places are closed at the minute because it's like it's quite sunny. Most places are closed at the minute because it's like siesta, which we didn't know. So we found somewhere open to have a drink until everywhere opens again. But this is the view. A draft alpha. <laughs> We've got some nuts. Show us me. Wow, they are funky nuts. I've gone for this, which apparently is like the beer from Rhodes. You can't see it in the shade. Yeah, apparently it's like brewed here, that's what they said. And then you've gone for the 
the popular one, the traditional. Traditional, what's it? Alpha. Alpha. Alpha, because you're the alpha male. <laughs> <laughs> the other side, and it's so windy. This is the beach, but like, I don't, I don't think it's a beach beach, because it's yeah. a pebble beach. But it's so windy, you probably can't even hear us. Look at Luke's hair. <laughs> Going out to the pier. Oh, it's so windy! It's so windy! <laughs> Look! <laughs> Look at our hair! They're definitely English. <laughs> so are we. <laughs> Look at this. The sea. <laughs> Good evening. It is now. <laughs> I just got Luke closed his move ring he's on the toilet. Um, it's now 8 o'clock at night. Um, lovely. Thanks for that information. Um, we're ready to go. I've gone for like lots of layers because it's actually quite a bit colder than I anticipated and lots of my outfits do not involve... Um, they're like little cami like <laughs> silk style dresses with like no jackets or very thin jackets so that's going to be fun um but this is the ootd for tonight i've gone silk skirt um taller 365 turtleneck this little jacket and then this which i actually wore to the airport so i'm like it might not go but at least i'll be warm that's my that's my like poa um so the plan is to go for dinner. I feel like I've not really filmed much today. Like the last shot was probably either us in a restaurant having a beer or walking around. But that's basically all we've done today. We've done a little bit of walking around, came back, had a nap, and then we've been in the room. Oh no, we went to the shop, got some like water, that kind of thing. That prosecco out of the freezer actually. Prosecco. But what we didn't realise is that today is, what is it? National Independence Greek Day. National Independence Day for Greece. So, lots of places are closed, <laughs> which we did not realise. So yeah, maybe plan that. 25th of um, March is Greeks International Day, which means basically just everywhere is shut. Um, but well, uh, the shops are shut. Like some obviously like supermarkets are open, that type of thing. Well, they were open today, so let's hope not. Um, so yeah, let's go. We don't even know where we're going, we're saying let's go, but we don't have a <laughs> Well, let's go out and see what we can find. <laughs> this is where we've come to. I won't be able to film Based much on that. because, <laughs> you know, we're both like sorting our hair out. We won't be able to film much because they're playing a lot of music, but the menu looks really nice and great. They have a whole vegan section. So yeah, this is what it's called. So this is my dish. I've gone for like a spaghetti arabiato with, um, I think these are like, I'm not even sure, uh, pecorino cheese. I think it was like pancetta, that was it. Got some bread, and then you've got the vegan tomato pasta. So very similar, really. So we're in Ronda. It's like fully like a little forest. Um, I've just come to the toilet and they're like, miles away so yeah oh there's also a little step there <laughs> um i just thought i'd like show you this is um this is really nice if you come to Rhodes town and you're looking for a place that's a little bit nice and a little bit different highly highly recommend um ronda and highly 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 recommend not cutting your own fringe and then hating it because that's what i've done that is what i've done but yeah it's like a little jungle it's really nice we're home um, what did you think of Rhonda? Very good. Very good. I really enjoyed it there. Luke said, is it appropriate? No, acceptable if we go to the same place every night for food while we're here. But yeah, I just wanted to come on and say we really enjoyed tonight. Um, it wasn't ridiculously expensive on a price point. It was open till 2am, but we have not stayed until 2am. Um, it's half 11 and we're probably going to go to bed. So I thought I would come on to close the vlog and um, say goodnight and we will see you tomorrow. Bye.
Oh. Night-night. <laughs> See you night-night. Adios. He's trying to sort the air con. <laughs> night-night, guys. Good morning, good morning, good morning, everybody. It's actually sunny here. Woo! <laughs> this sun's actually quite warm, you know. Yeah. This is the only four-length mirror that we have. And it's a window, but it works. Um, this is the OO today, OOTD. Got trainers with the white socks, white shorts, Tala 365 t-shirt today, and this red cover up, um, which I showed in my haul. And that is my flannel that I take my makeup off with. <laughs> Lovely, hanging on the wall. Um, so yeah, the plan for today, we are gonna go to Old Town, have a look around, see what there is to see at Old Town. Yes, Mr. Mullock is here. Suitcase. You need to close your suitcase. We're not unpacking, which I nearly always, every holiday, unpack. I'm just looking at like where I can rest you on. Every holiday I unpack and like put all of my clothes into the wardrobe. This is one of the first holidays I've like not unpacked. And I'm actually kind of enjoying it. I'm actually kind of enjoying living out of the suitcase because I know you never unpack but it actually makes me like put clothes away and like keep tidier because I have to look I have to like, put it all where am I back in my suitcase so all this like floor space like normally that would probably have been covered in clothes and it's not because I'm being tidy just today we are going for this Zara perfume my friend actually bought me this that's the name of it Twilight Mauve? I don't know. It smells really nice. It's quite a light smell. It's like a sweet, floral, light. I always spray way too much perfume. But hey, I like to smell it. I really like the bottle as well. It's so cute. I feel like it matches my nails quite nicely. Anyway, we're ready to go. That's what we're doing. One extra spray. Why not? While we wait. <laughs> um. So yeah, I, we've got, I said, I feel like today, walk around, find a nice like pub, bar type thing, sit down, play card games, drink some rosé wine. <laughs> so yeah, let's go. This, what did I call it? Grandmaster's Palace or something. There's probably like all this history. And we, looks cool though. Doesn't it? Them balls symbolise stuff. Probably. This side's like the shrubbery. Look at you standing there. Poser. <laughs> it is, isn't it? How cool is all this? Look at these. <laughs> this is where they like shot the arrows from. The little I can't even see over the shop. <laughs> What's down here? Just grass. This is like... Maybe. There's like a palm tree over there, look. Yeah, maybe. Or maybe not. This is just like how they like protected the city type thing. We need to find like one of those <laughs> placard things that like tell you about where you are. So we're just wandering around aimlessly. Oh, car.
There we go, that's the castle. We've just come out and walked down the path that I filmed before we went in, um, just to see what's down here. Probably go and try and find like a pub or restaurant or cafe now so we can have a drink, um, cause it's like kind of lunchtime. But no, that was really good. I think we, well, we paid 10 euro each for a ticket and it gets us in this castle, a museum. It's like people's back garden. Is that a drone? Don't know, there's a place up there, look. that looks like someone's house maybe. Um, where else does that ticket get us into? Oh, an art gallery. And somewhere else, what was the other one? Oh, a church, the church. So, unfortunately, while we're here, some of the weather looks like it's not that great. Like, it, we might get rain on Wednesday. So I said, now we know that we can use that ticket and we can use it over like, other days we don't have to just buy the ticket and then use it straight away we can use it on different days that um when it rains that'll be something quite good to do like going to the museum or the gallery this is the road by the way so it's really cool so yeah we're gonna go try and find Someone a cafe the, uh, up the door. <laughs> um what did you make of it would you recommend it yeah definitely yeah. Part of the history, part of the culture, isn't it? And if you didn't want to get the ticket to go in like all the things, you just want to go in the castle, that was four. Four euro. Four euro, which definitely worth it. For four euro, mm. definitely. So I will see you when we find a cafe. This is where we're going, but the tree is right over the side. This is where we're going. Oh, it's on the floor as well. <laughs> Could have just shown the floor. <laughs> it looks like Nelly. We've come here, uh, Mama Sophia, just for a little snack by the castle. Very nice. This is what we've got mixed vegetables and garlic bread with dips. Mm -mm -mm, looks good. It does look very good. It's all gone. It's nice, I want it. Really good. Really good. 10 10. Really, really good. What? Really, really, really good. So we've come to the castle ground now. We've got some crisps. Look at the bag of, look at the size. For preference, hold this bag of crisps. <laughs> it's huge. And we've got Prosecco, little glasses. Uh, we've came with our oh, towel. Geez. We're just going to sit here in the sun with the castle, have some f crisps, even though we've just literally just ate like the last clip was us eating. It was, but it was a snack. It was only a starter. Um, and then we've got Luke's speaker just there in card games and just chill out. show it you in the lift but I've gone with this blue shirt and linen trousers and I'm even socks and sandal in it because 
I've even double layered as well. Look. Because, yeah. Thank you. Because it is cold. These are our outfits. <laughs> this is a really good mirror for like outfits, but the lift is tiny. Excuse me. Oh, I forgot it's on this side. This is this is how small this lift is. Like I don't think it. Like if we stand side so, so, face that way, <laughs> that's the width of this lift. But it's a vibe. On. This is where we've come to. I love this little like tag on here, look. And I think I'm gonna get Master's gear off. So I will show you it when we um, when it arrives. But yeah, this is where we are. Very green. So one thing to note: <laughs> Porsche sizes are huge. <laughs> like <laughs> this is my hand on this plate. I know the salad is massive. I think we could have got away with just a little gear off. <laughs> God. A bit. Have a bit now. No, but you might want it back. <laughs> <laughs> the guys just brought this over to us because Luke's obviously vegetarian and vegan and they didn't have anything on the menu, so we basically had to get like a salad and pizza, like basically starch and like make our own dish. So he brought this over to us. We don't even know what it is. Show the bottle. He said black uzo. Did he? Yeah. I thought he said it's like uzo. I, I think you said it's like uzo, like it's not yeah. anything on the box. Go on, you go first. No, did you get No, you go. Okay. Did you get hey, wait, wait, wait. Cheers. We've opened it. Salud. No, it's Yamas. Yamas. I dropped it. I'm going to Spanish. Yamas. In one. <laughs> That's usually. That's petrol. That's funny because when you watch that back, you're going to see your face, and I'm just like, mm, it's nice. I just burped and it came back up. No, I need a break. I need a break. I've been defeated. I've been defeated. I can't eat anymore. I'm literally like bursting at the seams. Luke's done well. Only a few pitters. It's like all his chips. Half, well. Yeah. Salad's nearly all gone. So we've done well. Yeah. That's fucking awful. Uzo, really good. Awful. Gave it as an apology. Have you filmed it or not? Yeah. Oh, have you? God, it's gone to my head. <laughs> Right, he's making me do another one. Uno mas. What's that mean? One more. Uh oh. <laughs> but look at mine. Put in Spanish. Put yours next to mine. <laughs> I was like, no, I'm not doing it. The only reason she's drinking it is because I physically cannot have any more in my glass. <laughs> I was like, I'm not doing it. And I offered the guy, I said, Can, will you have a shot with me? And he was like, I can't, I'm on medication. I was like, I thought it would have been quite nice to have a shot with him as a thank you, but he was like, I'm on medication. That's fair. Right. Yamas. Yamas. <laughs> <laughs> that was more manageable. Chaser. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> so this is where we've been tonight. This week, by the way, is really nice. And then this is <laughs> where I wanted to go because it had pretty fairy lights. And the person here is who recommended down there. So this is where we're probably just going to have a drink now and end the night. New cat in training. What's this? <laughs>